Hey there, thanks for tuning into the Land and Home Show. This video is all about the top 10 counties that you're gonna find dollar to acre value here in the Bluegrass region. Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in. I'm Stephen J.V. Davis, your land specialist and residential realtor here in Central Kentucky and beyond. And so if you watched my last video, I talked about the top five most expensive counties here in the Bluegrass, and today uh, we're talking about the top 10. I won't bother you with how I got the numbers I got, that's in the last video, and I won't really bother you with um, what exactly the Bluegrass is and how that is segmented because that's also in the last video. You should be able to click somewhere on this screen or if you're on IGTV, you can uh, you know, find it under my Instagram television section. Uh, so I'll just jump right in after I open up my phone because again, don't have these memorized. Okay, so with number 10, we have Anderson County. Anderson County's county seat is Lawrenceburg. Um, I believe wild turkey is made in Lawrenceburg, uh, which is a bourbon if you're not a bourbon or whiskey fan. Um, it comes in at about $6,695 per acre of raw land between 5 and 15 acres. So all of these numbers are going to be qualified by 5 to 15 acre plots of raw land. We're not talking about all land or big acreage or land even with the house. This is raw land, 5 to 15 acres within the bluegrass. And so Anderson County comes in at $6,695 per acre. Um, next at number 9 is Pendleton County. Pendleton County is pretty far north. It's like basically bordering the Ohio River. Uh, straight up 75 if you were to be coming from Lexington. And it comes in about $6,200 per acre. And its county seat is Falmouth. Um, usually if you get a call from Falmouth, it probably means that it's spam. Um, number eight is Bracken County. I've got a really awesome farmer friend who runs uh, a farming operation that's owned by him and his family. Um, that's also in Northern Kentucky, also used to be a huge center for tobacco operations back when tobacco was more of a thing in this state, sadly it is not, um, but it comes in about $5,100 per acre with the county seat of Brooksville. In number seven is Bath County. Bath County is a little north, like slightly from Lexington, but just much further east, so it's headed on into uh, Moorhead, if you know where Moorhead State is, it's in Round County. Um, Bath County is going in that direction. Um, I don't know if you consider that Eastern Kentucky still or if it's Central Kentucky. Anyway, its county seat is Owingsville and in, and in Owen County, I'm sorry, in Bath County, it's about $4,900, almost almost $5,000, just shy of $5,000 an acre. Um, so it ranks number seven for best value. Um, number six for best, best value would be Owen County. Owen County has the county seat of Owenton. Owen County is like northwest of Lexington and it has, um, what does it border? I believe it borders the north side of Woodford County, I want to say. Um, we have like 120 counties here, so like forgive me if I mess this up. But Owen County ranks at about $4,700 an acre of raw land for 5 to 15 acres. Um, actually, $4,753.64 with the county seat of Owenton. Ranking number five for best dollar to acreage value is Henry County. Henry County is also a northern county in Kentucky, uh, coming in at $4,247, give or take, um, with the county seat of Grange, Kentucky. Next up is number four on the list. Number four for best dollar to acreage value is Robertson County. Robertson County is a very, very small county, and it is very, very north in Lexington, at least, or sorry, from Lexington, uh, but in the state of Kentucky, and it comes in about $3,500 per acre with the county seat of Mount Olivet. In number three, we have Montgomery County. Uh, I actually go to this county quite a bit. Uh, this is where Mount Sterling is. If you're familiar, Mount Sterling is considered to be kind of the bridging city between Central Kentucky and Eastern Kentucky. So I guess maybe it's kind of both, but in any case, uh, it comes in at $3,200 per acre, $3,246 give or take per acre for raw land between five and 15 acres. Um, number two would be Grant County. Grant County has the second best value for 
dollar an acre, uh, five to 15 acres. Its county seat is Williamstown, and actually in Grant County, you find some pretty great deer hunting there. Northern Kentucky in general um, is a place where we find some really like world-class deer, not just great, but like world-class deer. Um, Grant County is very small, and of course deer do not live by, uh, exclusively by the boundaries we make. You know, some deer do have, you know, road boundaries or river boundaries, but they kind of go wherever they want. Um, so there's certainly great deer hunting outside of Grant County, but Grant would be one of those places I'd say has a lot of hunting value. Um, and then number one, number one for best dollar to acreage value, five to 15 acres of raw land would be Nicholas County. Nicholas County is north. It touches Bourbon County. It is north of Bourbon County. And the dollar to acreage value you're going to get there for that, for that acreage class of raw land is $1,400. Its county seat is Carlisle or I've come to know a lot of Kentuckians, because I'm not a native Kentuckian, um, but a lot of native Kentuckians say Carlisle. They put the emphasis on the Lyle. Um, but in any case, $1,400 per acre for acreage, five to 15 acres uh, of raw land. So that is gonna be the number one value for dollar to acre if you are looking for five to 15 acres in the bluegrass region. And again, if you wanna know what the bluegrass region means, Refer back to my previous video. I think I'll probably make some sort of pop-up in this video so you can click on it. Uh, but in any case, that's all I've got for you. That was a mouthful. Hopefully that helps. And if you need any help digging into more of it, of course, I am a land man. I'd love to talk more about it. I'd love to help you buy it. I'd love to help you sell it. Uh, you can find all my info on whatever platform it is you're watching. Uh, but until then, I will see you later. It is time to get in some shade. Peace. Hey, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, and share. And of course, stay tuned for more.